What is this? Something's new on here. Let's close that. Hey, everyone. Hi. How are you guys? We are out at the 2023 Maryland, Maryland RV, RV show. show. It's a new show for us. This up here. So it's a, there's a lot of unknowns here. Unknown how our signal is going to be. Yes. Unknown how many RVs are here. Is it, it, it's broken down into three buildings. We've, we've hit two of the three Look so at far. Look little dog there. It's oh. an Italian gray or a whippet, actually. Um, all right, now where can go in here? So, yeah, it's okay. broken down to three different places, three different buildings. We went to the first building, which the reception's pretty bad. And that's where all the good stuff is. Where all the good stuff is, yeah. But it, it's basically a steel and cinder block building, which acts as a huge what? Faraday bag. If anybody knows what a Faraday bag is, put it in the comments below. I'm not going to give it away until we get an answer. Uh, so well, this still, building's a little bit better. We still got to wait give some time for people to come in. So we just have a couple. Um, but while we're waiting, let us know where you are watching us from. That just from. jumped up to 43 it did in like jump. a second. Yeah, it's, it's weird. Hi, Pierre and Laurel. What's up, they guys? Just came in. Hi, everybody else. Welcome. Um, and as, also how we sound. Yes. Do we look and sound okay? Um, do you want okay. to tell them what happened to you this morning? Why don't we wait for a few more people? Because okay, yeah. I think they'll really enjoy it. Why don't, why don't we do this? If you've watched our videos, you know MJ... Is accident prone. Let's say how. Let's how can we say this kindly? She has a bad streak with injuries <laughs> and accidents. So, something happened to her this morning. Put it in the comments below. What you think happened this morning? Okay, Laurel said we look great. They're at Daytona. They're in Daytona, of course. Nice. Um, the big race today. Going on. Yeah, that's a good. Yes, Klutz Hilda. Or maybe that's Pierre that's talking. Because Pierre calls me Klutz Hilda. Um, all right, so why don't we start walking around? So we're and, in the exhibition building right now. Yes, so there's three buildings. One is the large building, which houses all the, well, not all the motorized, most of the motorized, mm -hmm. a lot of trailers, fifth wheels. And this is a smaller one, which is where the good service is. They have a lot of, um, some motorized, a little bit of everything, yep. teardrops, things like that. And then the smaller one, I, I don't even know if that's, I think just trailers, we haven't been there yet, so. So this is gonna be mostly trailers in here, so a lot of times we do the motorized, but if you're interested in seeing some trailers, here we go. Do you want me to tell them first what happened and then we will? Was well, anybody put in the comments? Faraday bag stops signals from damaging your electronics, you somebody said, good. Well, it, it actually, it does, and it also, it stops signals from going out, so yes. Right, okay, let's, let's go on an, an RV or two and then I will share what happened to me this morning so here's the springdale <laughs> by keystone and everybody wants to know the show price there's the show price they're good with the prices here like yeah. having everything clearly marked let's just go inside really quick this reminds me of our jaco travel trailer it does it this this was our bedroom except we had the tv <laughs> in the wall tom's over here i'm like who's this guy with in the i was yeah, I was purposely ignoring you. <laughs> like, who's this guy in the I background? I sent you a message. I guess you didn't get it. Really? I sent it before. I said, let me know when you get here. Oh, we just we just went live. I know. I know. <laughs> All right. We'll talk we'll, to you a little we'll bit. We'll see you when we come out of here. I heard somebody in the background like, it's way too expensive. I'm like, who is this oh, guy <laughs> chirping in the background? <laughs> um, so this is, uh, you know. This looks just like our Jacob. It, it looks, yeah. I mean, it's smaller. Our Jago was 28. What is this? Uh, probably around there. Because this is this seems, almost identical yeah, setup. This seems a little smaller. Except it's... Reversed. Reversed, yeah. Yeah. And we had, you know, the the U-shaped dinette. Um, but, yeah. I do like the dark colors on here. I don't. <laughs> but I know you do. Okay. Let me just peek my head into that bedroom real quick. Okay. Hi, everybody. Happy you're here. Somebody said no cast or sling. Get this, get this dog. Oh my God, it's so cute. Oh, that's his dog. It's your dog. Oh my God, it's so cute. What's up? Yeah. Right, no worries. <laughs> Good to see you. Good to see you too. All right, we'll see you in a little bit. Okay. All right, All right. So this is what happened. All right. So I'm ready to, t and then we'll go. We'll go on. So maybe we'll do some motorized too, right? Because I don't know if there's any motorized in here. I thought they had here. some bees here. No. I, I thought uh, they did. Maybe. Okay. Here's what happened. I'll make this short and sweet. 
So I was... I'll just do RVs while you talk. Okay. So I am training for a half marathon. And I was running this morning on the treadmill. And I one step, I landed on my right knee and... But you yeah, didn't fall. I yelled. I didn't fall, but I couldn't put. I couldn't put. I had to jump onto my left leg off the tr like on the side of the treadmill, and then I couldn't walk. I couldn't put any uh, weight on my right leg. So something happened. I think I have. I think it's in my calf because I've been feeling tightness in my calves. Um, it's it's pretty bad. <laughs> I mean, I can walk, but I'm limping. It's very sore. So we'll see what happens. I'm supposed to run tomorrow. Um, we'll see what happens with that. But anyway, I'm walking. That's all that matters. I'm not in the hospital bed. So. All right. So that's the update. That's the update. Yes. So here's a Winnebago. This is the mini Winnie. Micro, micro mini. Correction. The micro, micro mini. mini Winnie. Here's the length, the weight. There are people in there, so we'll kind of continue. I see some, uh, what is that, an A-liner? That's a pretty cool looking A-liner. It's the stealth look. They're all going with the stealth looks, yeah. you know? Oh, here's a couple. Here, get, you want to grab this one? Oh, but nobody's on background. here. Oh. oh, that's all right. It'll be okay. I don't think it's going to pick it up on the mic. So here is a A-liner Scout. 15,999, 15 feet, 1,395 pounds. So you can pretty, I can tow this with the Mustang, I think. So. But you have incredible height on here. You do, well, that's the thing. If you stand in the middle, you do. <laughs> but you have a lot of sleeping space. So both sides. And is this one of the, is, no, this is not the Doesn't toilet. Because that's the air conditioner there. And then you have, you know, this comes up as your, as a table, I believe, dining table. It doesn't have a shower though, right? No, it doesn't have a shower or a Nothing, toilet. No yeah, yeah. Hmm. It's the, it's the outside air conditioner. So the run that I'm supposed to do is in Jersey City, New Jersey. So I used to run a lot and I haven't run in the last a uh, couple of years. I mean, I've been running on and off, but not consistently. So I've been going very, you know, coming back in slowly in terms of mileage. But uh, I don't know. We'll, let's see what happens. So this one has a toilet and shower. This one has the toilet? Yeah, How about the shower? Nice. It does have a shower, yeah. No. Oh, see, I, so like I like the way they, they did that. They... So this is, uh, yeah, see, this is cool. So you get your eating space, you get your sleeping space, toilet, kitchen here. What is this? Two burners. Yep. You get a two burner propane stove, Dometic fridge, and then this this pop up shower that just closes down. That's so cool. And that's and so you see here, you know, the curtain yep. goes right around there. Look nice how much windows. Space there. You stand yeah. By the, by the door there, you can see. Yeah, it's how very much space cool. I always like the A liners. They're very cool. Angela, <laughs> so it'll be interesting to see if the prices at some of the lesser known RV shows are higher or lower. Um, we're seeing some pretty high prices. Yeah. It's crazy. So let us continue. You know, again, MSRPs, they're high, but you probably have more bargaining power than in the past. Yeah, we went on some motorized today. Uh, we'll have a video coming out Actually, in yeah, the future really talking about some motorized. Um, there's some issues on some of them. There was one seen. that, yeah, we're not going to tell you, but watch for that coming out. It was, it was pretty bad. Like a very well-known... Manufacturer. Manufacturer, yeah. Anybody want to see fifth wheels? Sure. So, let's jump on some fifth wheels for you guys. It's the Forest River Rogue. Is this a toy Rogue hauler? Armored. 351 G2. I'm not sure. I don't think so. Yes, it is. It is, okay. Wow, there's a lot of people in here. Let's go. <laughs> Full carpet in the bedroom. Oh, no. Full carpet. <laughs> I like that alliance. So I always go to lift that up on the alliance. You have the storage. Oh, by the way, if you're wondering what this is, blended desserts. 
So it was this gluten free like stand in the vendors. Gluten free, dairy free. So what they had, well, this was the one dairy free thing they had. It was like banana, walnut, uh -huh. bread that Izzy, Izzy had to well, had to get. You know, you should always carry a knife. And did it not come in handy? They it cut did. Out some you cut slices. the bread. So I can pretty much stand in here. A lot of places for your shoes and. I wonder if there's storage under the bed. I'm not, I can't really lift it right now, but. Interesting shower here. You got the, the Jack and Jill entry on the bathroom. Yep. Let's get out of the way here. Shower. Radio shower. Who likes radio showers? Put it in the comments. Can Who's we some, see some today? fifth wheels? Yeah, we're going to hit some fifth wheels, Melody. We're on a fifth wheel right now. Yeah, well, this is a toy, toy hauler, but like. Regular fifth wheels without the toy hauler option. Right. You sales person, you got a nice bunk above. You got the drop down beds here. Yeah, quick, uh, here, hang on. Kind of oh, of that. That's oh, a wet bath. Huh. That's you interesting. Two full baths yeah, in yeah. That's pretty cool. So there's a decent amount of people here today. Yes. So if you're wondering if other shows are doing well besides Tampa, yeah. Now we don't know if people are buying or, but there are they're definitely looking. Oh, sorry. I don't know if anybody heard that. Oh, that, that last step. You drop, you drop no, that was a, that was a high. I did drop an F. I'm sorry, guys, if you Ten heard likes. that. No, because that was um, that step was super high. So uh, nobody should get that if they have knee issues or hip issues. Woo! There's a wolf pack. Oh, this is big. Oh, this is enormous. Is, it, is this a saber? Oh no, that's a rogue too. There's a Cherokee wolf pack. This is 45 feet three inches in length. Somebody said, Izzy, with you still working as a police officer, how do you guys have so much for RV content? We have no life. Blue pony. Somebody Zero. else asked no. that question. I, we just, I, and we say this all the time. We just work, like this morning, we were up at four at the gym by 4.30. And then until we get, until we could get by 4.15. I was in it, no. By 4, 4.45. No, by five, I think. <laughs> and then, and then we got to the show like way early. So... Yeah. Oh God, Jim, I'm so sorry. Did you hear me? Jim Estel said? said, "Howdy from Indiana, potty mouth." I'm so sorry, guys. It just, I now, stepped now down get, and I almost now we're gonna get went through the roof because of your filthy mouth. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> it hurt so bad. Does she sound like Carrie Heffernan? <laughs> I feel horrible. So regarding how we get content, oh, he said, "Just kidding." Okay. Don't what we do me. is we um we binge shoot. Right. Well, we come right. to a show. We, we, shoot we shoot a lot. Like in Tampa, we shot 22 videos. Yeah. So, so that lasts us a while. And then we shoot at home and then we shoot, you know, we go to dealers and shoot. So. And we always we always have this conversation. You know, we feel like we're so limited because of our time schedule that once I'm able to retire and really we're able to to see this beautiful country of ours travel. I mean, the content is, is going to be nonstop. You think we Matt. post a lot now? Just wait, people. <laughs> just wait. Everything in toy haulers and fifth wheels is just, I love it. It's just big, high, wide. Um, I gotta tell you, I'm not feeling this thing. This looks like it was kind of stapled together. Yeah. Well, yeah. But a uh, big pantry with some, oh, interesting, some, some drawers. What is the coolest thing you've seen at the show? Well, what about that the little scamp, uh, the Cortez. Cortez. Yeah, that's in the other building. It's like a hundred percent, like oh, molded piece. fiberglass. Yeah. yeah, it's pretty cool. It's very small, very small. But you suffer for your content. I don't know about suffer. I mean, because we, we enjoy, enjoy it. it, you know. But uh, these are low ceiling. Yeah, this is the this is for kids because this is. Actually, I'm, I mean, I'm 5'9", and it's, but I'm touching here, so if you're super tall, this is not going to work for you. I think, Pierre, you, should, you would agree, you should definitely get an inspection on this. If you yeah, it. yeah. A little piece of, I don't know, like, I don't know if you see that. There's like a weird piece of mold in there. Yes, that's Let me just perfect go back. for... Like, I'm not quite sure whether it's there. Let me see. I don't know. Right, like it's so. It's not put together. It's wide open in there. 
They just stuck you a know? piece of mold in to yeah. cut a hole or something. Oh, Angela said she just started looking at the Cortez Camper because they're based out of Cleveland. Yeah, they look pretty nice. Where she's from. Yeah, they're kind of cool looking. They're just very, yeah, getting very small. If you're into that small, it's very cool. Like, that's probably the least um, possibility of water intrusion in that. <laughs> no, it really would only be in, any, in the vent or AC unit, really. And you just keep that sealed, you should be okay. Pierre uh, is said that, is definitely. That a Oh, that needs an inspection for sure. Is that a wet bath no, or nothing? No, it's just a half. Oh, that's an interesting thing. You do that. You wash your hands like. All right. I hope this has a higher, lower uh, step because know. that was, that was rough. I might need your hand, hun. <laughs> yeah, these are. Oh, that's a little better. Right. But, okay. Let's continue. All right. Let's move on. Yeah, it's, it's great to see the crowds here, you know. The other building's definitely more crowded. Way more crowded. That's so let's, one, let's find goodies. a non-toy hauler. I just said hauler. I heard it. <laughs> I couldn't catch it fast enough. How about the Rockwoods? People like Rockwoods. I see one over here. I'm saying like a fifth wheel, like a non-toy oh. hauler uh, fifth wheel, I meant. Hmm. Do they have any? I don't know. <laughs> Okay. What is this here? You want to is look at a Rockwood? Rockwood? Yeah. Do Class A's have the most things that go wrong with them or that need to be fixed as compared to Class B's and C's and trailers? No, they're just more expensive Yeah, to fix. no. I mean, they all, yeah, they all have their <laughs> issues. All. So here's a Rockwood signature. This is a very large travel trailer. Yeah, Blue Ox um, thinks inspection is needed. Yes, they do, Jim. <laughs> So, so you, you buy this, you, you're going to definitely want to have at least a uh, three-quarter ton or something like this. That's the show price. If you have one RV show to go to for the best price, which one would you go to? It doesn't matter. Yeah, I mean... It, it really doesn't because it, it's not even the final price. Right. It's 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 how you um, negotiate. and But yeah. in terms of the best um, selection, selection I, you know, probably Tampa, I would think. Yeah. Yeah, you, the, the RV shows to, to get to see a whole bunch of different things in right. one place. But like, that doesn't mean you're getting the best price. No, no, not necessarily. Are you going? You going oh, oh, yeah. oh, okay. Packed in here, huh? Yeah. Yeah, a lot of guys have like the little tiny. Okay. It's a little crowded. There is the model, the E337RL, the rear living room. Yeah. I remember we came on one I, one of these the last time I and I remember I remember this I remember this curved um, counter space because I remember saying I could load it up with hashtag stuff. Now remember this is a trailer. It's not a fifth wheel we're on. Right. This is washer dryer prep in there. You know, plenty of wardrobe space if you don't want to use it for that. I don't know if I ever want to tow this going down the road. This is pretty big. Yeah, yeah. It's very large. Oh, you like that? Just boop, boop. This Grand Design 321, or 3210 BH there. No idea. They're in the other building, yeah, Grand Design, but there's we no didn't really there. look. We didn't really look through Grand Design yet. But yes, the, unfortunately, there's no signal. Oh, I like, see, I like this. Bathroom. And here's your toilet. Some cabinet space. And you have a max air fan in here also. This is a nice, uh, really again, nice. trailer. You know what this reminds me of in terms of trailers? The Eagle. Yeah, the Jayco yeah. Eagle. Yeah, it just it feels like a fifth wheel. You know, so you have, look at this whole area here. Whole prep space with plenty of cabinets. Got the drop down lights, which I like. Got nice island. And nice. then you have your fireplace. Yeah, more, um, you know, 
space there to put stuff. If we had this trailer, like, we might not have got a motorhome. I, I know. <laughs> you like the uh, the fake fireplace, <laughs> fake bricks? Let's see, wait. Looks nice, though. Can you, you hold got... this really quick? Because I, I think this, um, this will be the B-roll for the other video we did. You put Do Not Disturb, right? On no, your phone? No, I didn't. You probably... Nobody calls me. Okay. That's we right, probably... we just don't answer it. Actually, yeah, you have but to it, use your phone. It doesn't disconnect? I don't think so. Okay. Somebody said that's the one we were getting through Matt. Cool. Oh, nice. What do you want in terms of B-roll? So you guys so were just... Of the living B -roll. area. Yeah, babe. I'll stand that's a, well, just that area there. Yeah. All right, I'll wait outside. Okay. Are you just watching me walk out like an like it's an old lady? This. Huh? <laughs> I'm sorry to interrupt, but I see your guys. Oh, awesome. Well, you're on live right now. We're live on YouTube. Say hi. I love you. You guys want to say hi? Thank you so much. I love your video. Thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. We'll do one more. Yeah, we'll do one more. Keep seeing. Do you want to? Were there fifth wheels here? Did we miss a fifth wheel? Or were they just all toy haulers? They look like they were tie holders. How about um some of the little Oh yeah, let's do these little uh the little teardroppers. The little yeah, there's what? new camps and there were little guy max. Which I really like those. I they, they are cool, low. man. They're like better made. Yeah, they're very cool. Tiny. So a bunch of Freedom Express. Congrats, Expresses. sweet thing. They just brought a an RV in Tulsa, Oklahoma. What'd you get, sweet thing? Tommy D, pick me up a replacement snap pad while you're there. Yeah, sure, no problem. <laughs> Wire us one thousand dollars. That includes labor fees. <laughs> okay. Let's go to the tab three twenty. We'd be showing any of the Super C motorhomes, Daniel. I think there's one here. There's one Nexus. Uh, no, they have the. Did um, they have something else? They have that Thor one. Oh, the Thor. Yeah, they don't really have many here, and unfortunately, where they are, that building has no service in terms of our, you know, being able to stream there. This is the tab. What's the weight of this one here? Is that somebody's asking? What is it? The, the weight. So How here are the anywhere? specs. Oh, there we go. 15.3, 1,946 pounds. Oh, they bought a Dutch Star 4369. From here? No, in Tulsa, Oklahoma. Oh, Congratulations. Nice. Did they it's take delivery favorites. or they just ordered it? They said they bought one two weeks ago. So. Nice. Ibex. We went on that one, I think. Did we? Yeah. Well, how about this little tiny thing here? What is this? The little guy Max? Micro, micro Max. I can't stand in here. <laughs> it's good if you're like 5'8. So this is the little guy Max Micro Max CT 1511. There's the weight, the price. So I'm 5'9 and I can't fully extend my <laughs> Is there a bathroom in here? My head. No, there is not. There's an air conditioner, sleeping space, a little table there. Oh, I'm sorry. There is right here. As soon as you walk in. You but no, to, what is there? An outdoor shower? You get maybe? to crap in a box. No, you crap. Oh, yeah, you crap in a box. And you shower outside, I'm guessing. There's your storage. Still on the Solar fence. Top. Class A or Super C. Yeah, Deborah, tell us about it. <laughs> right there with you. The Micromax is adorable, not for full time. Yeah, no. Uh, not for anybody over five feet tall. I'm not going to say Vern Troyer if anybody Who's watches there? it. No. no, stop. No, because I always bring it. That was like a joke. I brought him up once talking about I loved him. I loved him. I'm glad you think that's, that's a joke. No, I know not say it was a joke. It, those movies were so funny. Those were one of your favorite movies, yeah, remember? When he played Mini Me. Anyway, what brand is that? That little, little guy Max. Little guy Max. Yeah. So I think we're kind of wrapped up in this building. There's not much here. Yeah, I mean, this is what we're going to see. Tomorrow morning, mm -hmm. 
we'll maybe try again to see if we can get some service in the other building. And because that's where a lot of the good stuff is. Yeah. Um, but because this is mostly, you know, travel trailers and. And there's more in the other haulers. building. So make sure you're subscribed, notification bell. We'll probably go around 9 30 tomorrow in the morning. Yeah. If we're going to go live, we'll do it from the other building. When there's right. nobody there, there'll be a lot less issues with a uh, signal. Super important, guys. If you missed our video last Correct. night, you yes. need to go watch that video because we are giving away a Blue Eddy power station. EV70S, $520. Right, $520 value. Um, and, but you have to enter by tomorrow at 5 p.m. Eastern time. And we said Correct. that. Clear. And there's instructions in the video of how to do it. I'm amazed so, how many people can't follow guys, directions. Guys, the amount, we got so many entries. So if you enter, it is going to be tough. But there were uh, quite a few hundred entries. But um, at this point, we're definitely every two minutes is coming in on my phone. But uh, you Which have you to just, just, yeah, just follow the directions. It's free no to enter. Attached, and you could win a $520 power station, which, which is, is really awesome. good. I mean, Blue Eddy stuff is really good. So yeah, so make sure, again, subscribe. Watch that video. Notification bell on. We'll go on live tomorrow. If that works, we'll go live Monday again yeah. from that same building. But thanks, you guys, for joining Thank us. We're you. getting a lot of videos here. So if you missed our lives, there will be videos from the show. They just right. won't be live. Take care, guys. Bye.